actually haven't played for, for a long time, but um, growing up, obviously, I've played a lot of uh, touch footy, especially at school, and it's, um, it's a great sport. It's, it's a really good combination, the, um, the two organisations, organisations getting together, and it's um, long overdue. Um, oh, it, it, um, it means the world. Obviously the NRL's got a great profile and um, Touch Footy's got a massive following but I suppose not such a great profile so hopefully this marriage will help um, Touch Footy as obviously it's going to help Rugby League. Obviously a lot of um, talented people involved in Touch Football, I mean that means a lot of things for them and their future in the game. Yeah, yeah, it's really cool. It, as everyone's been saying today, it doesn't discriminate touch footy. You can um, anyone of any age of any sex can play footy, and um, yeah, it's really exciting. And as you said, it's um, there's um, some celebrities here today, so it's really nice. Um, Oh, well, mate, lo losing's not great, obviously. Um, we've got an opportunity this Friday night to turn that around, but, um, yeah, the last month or so hasn't been great, but uh, we need to keep believing in ourselves and believing that what we're doing is right, and um, we're missing a couple of our best players as well, which doesn't help, but, um, mate, we'll, we'll, we'll be, we're, not, we're not travelling along too bad, mate. We're still sitting second on the table, so things could be worse. Um, oh, yeah, mate, semi, semi is. Um, um, I really, I, to be honest, I haven't seen the incident. I've, I've read about it in the paper, but um, yeah, I can't comment a great deal on it. But um, hopefully, we don't miss him because he's such a good player. It's a nasty allegation to have thrown at you before he's throwing their support around him. Oh yeah, of course. You know, when anyone goes through any sort of um, adversity, you know, as mates, you got to be there for him. But um, yeah, like I said, I. Have, I I honestly haven't seen the incident, so I um, I can't comment. But um, yeah, we'll, we'll we'll be right, mate. Um, you know we're a good team, and uh, with or without Sammy Burgess, we'll be okay. Manly's looking hot at the moment, aren't they? Yeah, they're on fire. They, um, you know, teams like Manly and Melbourne, they're always they always come hot this time of year, and um, um, obviously this season's no exception for those two teams. And uh, we've got our hands full on Friday night, and uh, I think they've got the best backline in the competition. To be honest, their um, their centres are. Are the two strike centres of the comp, and their halves are awesome. The fullback scores a million tries, so they're a great team. No, not at all, mate. It, um, this little time uh, leading into the finals is very important, and if you're getting easy games, it's really not the best pre preparation. So we've got some tough games, and um, we'll really iron out some creases and work out where we need to improve. And I think I said on Sunday, it's the perfect run into the semis.